Hello guys, it's Kevin again. Once again, we're playing Westland Survival. In this particular video, I actually kind of go on a little run at Ask Grew. Why I want to do this is simply because I need some of the wood that's located right here. This is the only place where you can get it, and I need a couple of hundred planks actually for this, for making the steamboat finished. That's a lot of runs back and forth. <clears throat> if you have the wagon, you're actually in keel of transporting uh, even more without actually going back and forth. So you can just fill up that, let your wagon stay right here. That's a little trick for you guys if you want to do that. Now, I don't want to do that. I rather want to go back and forth because I'm actually doing dailies as well. Uh, so let's see here. We're going to go here. Uh, the items that I need here, and I'm going to show you guys that. It's this one right here. Uh, they just go through. Here we go. Sorry, this one right here. This uh, board right here is the one I want to have. And you can see I'm not getting much of here. I have about 31 at my home base for one run, actually. Uh, and that was not just one run. It was uh, running back and forth until I actually filled it up. Uh, we are incapable of getting small events as well. But when it's actually items that I don't need, I don't want to do them. So let's see here. We're going here. Normally it is located down in the bottom of these areas. We don't want to fight any of these. Just want to go for this so that we have our harvesting set up for this. Oh my God, they blow up themselves. Stupidity in this area, funny. You can always use some flowers, so every time, oh my God. Every time I do this, something come up and changing my way of it. So let's see here, we're gonna go with this one. We really wanna have items, all of these items here. Sometimes there's, uh, um, iron inside of it, not just iron, but uh, steel. I definitely need that. Go with this one as well. Everything with this gun is 625 smackers of destruction. It's giving me a quite good range of shooting here, so let's see what we're getting. Okay, right here, nine of these, perfect. Perfect. I have a high uh, spirit, meaning that I'm not in getting attacked by any of these animals in these areas. So I'm a free runner here. So getting, knowing that, it's not making any of this actually a fight for me. So let's just take that. I need any more coal at my home base. I'm filled up with that. Uh, you also need uh, coal for actually uh, that task. Um, on, on the steamboat building, but uh, it is a long way for me for actually, uh, it's I think it's about 100 you need, so I had, I had a lot of that, so it doesn't actually matter. Taking that right now, so let's see, we still don't have what we really came for. It's located nearby, hopefully. <laughs> there we go, more people. Well, let's just kill that. And here we go. Oh shoot, I didn't see that. Was it wolf just shooting? Okay. Definitely not what we wanted, so. Back on track here. Trying to figure out where they put it. I'm not taking these uh, animals for friends unless I find this area because I don't want to uh, lure any of these uh, wolves at me or other um, animals. When, when you have a friend, you will end up actually, um, yeah, getting killed. You are incapable of getting killed. Don't need to help anyone. You can just take whatever it is, the loot is. It's not because you're not going to fight and help anyone, but there's no need of doing that so let's see here where is it it is seriously just here we're going back in circles guys let's see we're gonna go inside of that area I didn't do that here it is now you can see uh, on the minimap these are the uh, things here there's just one little uh, hints in it and this is the one right here, this is the one we want to kill. 
So we're gonna kill this one. We're gonna get uh, the high fur from it. Uh, it is actually okay when you have this weapon here. I remember dying so many times with that good weapon. So do recommend focusing on making high level weapons. And it is this one right here that we're gonna take. My character is uh, chopping down everything on auto faster than anything else because, uh, yeah, I have VIP. So remember, if you have VIP, you speed up everything on two times faster, uh, making it easier for you to loot. So this is one of the games that I actually do recommend uh, VIP. Uh, this one and Muted Depriver is actually just giving higher chance for looting and that's what it's all about right here let's see we don't need that so it's a set so these are the items that i need here you can see 15 every time that's not much so let's just go back here out again just to be sure see if we can actually These guys right here that was easy to kill. Let's see what we can get out of that. There is a chest right here, we're just gonna see that before I go out. And then I'm gonna go back and forth, because that's the thing that I do when I'm actually doing these kind of runs here. I have to leave nothing inside of it worth anything for me, so let's see. Uh, sometimes in this location here, if you had the wagon, you just need to know that you are incapable of actually getting uh, things like um, your, uh, um, things like, like a, a, a safe, and that safe is actually going to be opening up, uh, traveling back to the Silver Tune area. This is the main town. And at that point, you're incapable of going in with this big safe. Now, you need to, the wagon for doing it. So when you have the wagon right here, like you can see, I have uh, about uh, 15 slots at that one. And you can keep on upgrading for getting even more. I do recommend that you do that as fast as possible as well. Um, well that's actually uh, what I'm doing right now. So I want to show you guys how far I am right now on this one. I am actually not that far, but I have couple of these one right here is just traded that you go trade those at um, the trader <laughs> of course at uh, the trademark or whatever it's called um, at that point you're in capable of actually one of the guys have it and you're in capable of getting up to three of these every time you can buy them for three golds each one of them and you can see you need a 50 of these smackers here and so we're still a couple of them left back before we can get it but these are the items that i have been putting in right now and i'm still struggling getting this one right here and making these uh alley plates as well i'm almost finishing up this one you can see you have 23 of this at home and yeah 20 of these at the storage as well so we're slowly getting toward it uh and of course this one so i'm looking forward for making this one this is one of my highest uh, priority right now so that I can open up this one. You can buy your way out of it. I don't like that idea uh, But I'm going to might going to do it when I'm just needing these last one uh, I did that on on my wagon just buying one of the the items for that it is Taking so long to make the wagon as well. I don't recommend it's not uh, I don't think it's worth it uh, taking that wagon like that. Now the good thing when you're doing these kind of runs here and you need special items, I do this. This is gonna make it easier for me to just harvest these items that I have inside of here. So when I'm going back right now, uh, I'm actually incapable of just focusing on that. And now I'm just gonna show you guys that's a little trick that I do on all of these survival games. They have the same setup, so it is actually pretty easy uh, doing it. Now we're doing this one right here, so let's see here, we're going to go just inside. And the only thing we need to do is just press uh, auto-collect 
it will collect more than that. It will also collect the items that I have inside of it. So that means not just a tree, but it's going to collect actually all of the items that I have inside of it. So when I have items like uh, this one right here, the flower here, I'm actually in capable of uh, also harvesting that. So these are the items that it's gonna collect right now. This is on auto. So you see that's going quite faster. Uh, and don't waste time on anything else here. my pants here. Definitely not hitting it. There we go. And we just keep on going here. Of course I'm going to harvest, uh, uh, sorry, looting the chest as well. But going quite fast and that's why I'm using these kind of big axes here that are quite valuable for me right now. And we have the ability inside of my home base for actually Re uh, remaking some of the tools that are getting broken. So if tools are almost getting broken uh, or used, I just um, uh, repair it again. But to be honest, it is not every time it is worth doing. I found out that the items like um, axes are actually costing the same amount for building a new one. So it doesn't matter trying to save that. Uh, it is not in my opinion worth it. So let's see here. There's no flowers in this area, meaning that we just go out right now. We're not getting any more, we're just looting for this one. So I don't wanna waste my gun on anything else by killing this one, go back and forth. So this is how I do mass looting in areas. I know it's gonna be waste of a lot of energy, but it is still sometimes just press the work, uh, 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 walk button right here, and we'll uh, walk taking 20 minutes for going to that area, I lock off, play something else, going back in, back and forth like that. I normally go for the uh, flooded uh, area right here, and then I loot all of the items that I can on auto as well. There's at that location a lot of these flowers, plus there's uh, also the highest flower that we can up getting for making a healing potion like this one right here. Uh, this one is one of the best healing potion. And it's this flower right here that's actually located at this uh, area right here. So, hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, this is what I'm doing right now. Struggling to make the steamboat. And yeah, I don't know. How far are you guys? Are you playing this game? If you're playing this game, please write that in comment. And say how far you are at this one. Or if you're stuck in anything, I really want to help you guys out on that as well. So, please write that in comment. See you guys next time. Bye, guys.